Okay, uh, hello everyone. Uh, this is Francisco from Insiders, and we are very glad to be in Paris with a good friend from Insiders. Uh, today, tonight, we are, are with Caroline Eva. Uh, how are you, Caroline? Good, great. <laughs> Thank you very much for sharing some time with us. Uh, as you may already know, Insiders is a it's a project, uh, kind of new project, where we uh, bring or we invite specialists in different areas to speak, especially to the young people, mm -hmm. about inspiring ideas on how to uh, how to improve their actions, how to uh, be better in what they do, etc., etc. Okay, so we would like you. I mean, we know that you have uh, have had a lot of experiences in your professional life uh, here in Paris and abroad, and I think that you have something to share to these young people. Okay, one of these experiences that I know you had is as a delegate, mm -hmm. yes, of the uh, One Young World Conference. Okay, to was uh, held in. Johannesburg this year. So, can you tell something about this conference that you were? Uh, I mean, you, you talked us that uh, you told us that it was uh, an inspiring conference where these public fi public figures tell the young people to uh, to take action in some ways. Can you can you share something? Sure, sure. So the One Young World Summit is all about empowering the young generation and this whole empowerment process is done through contact with great leaders. So, so the One Young World Summit was 1,200 delegates this year from 190 countries. So basically every country in the world was represented. It was held for the first time in Africa, which was also a great opportunity. And we had the chance of having not only conferences, but also Q&As and, and rather informal talks with uh, such people as Kofi Annan, Mohamed Yunus, Ariana Huffington, Ron Garan, Richard Brunson. I mean, we had 45 different speakers, so obviously there are too numerous to be able to name them here. But it was really about the older generation or the senior generation, whatever you want to call it, sharing with the young people their keys on how to empower them. And what I really remember from that conference is that you have to dare you don't take any risk by asking people their opinion you don't take any risk by launching a project if you i mean even if the project fail you will have never failed because you will have learned something and you will have felt empowered in the process and what we really learned was that if you want to have 100 just ask for 1000 you know go for the bold the crazy idea and then maybe the smaller more reasonable idea will move forward but even if you're doing only one percent and one percent at one point you will have the hundred percent that you were looking for and i think that was that was really the strongest idea i got because as young people very often we feel like we don't have the power we're not that not yet in the professional situations that allow us to take the right decisions we don't have the right mentors etc but when you have Mohamed Yunus or Kofi Annan telling you, but you can do it, just try it, just do it. And if it doesn't work, then try again. If it doesn't work, then try again with, with other people and learn to network and learn to work in networks. You just, you just want to go for it. You just want to try. And also what really struck me in that conference is that we, as a young generation, we need mentors. And, and we need not to be afraid to go to people and ask them for help. And once, once again, you, you can ask for nine, ten people, they will say no, and at some point some really great person will tell you that, yes, and you only need one yeah. to get started. Yeah, that's true, and I think this is very important because we live in a globalized world, and a globalized world has a lot of opportunities, but also a lot of challenges. So it is important that uh, you, you take action and you don't um, get frustrated okay, at first, opportunity fail. It's important that you keep going and going and going, as these people say, and they are very, very right by saying that. So, uh, what, what would be the, the recommendation that you say to, to young people? I mean, you already said very uh, interesting things for them about uh, pursue their goals, etc. But taking your personal experience, mm -hmm. okay? 
something that motivated you, for example. What what would you recommend young people to go for the dreams? Okay, uh, maybe they can say or some of them can say, okay, it's very nice how people say things to others. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But what do you think can make a young person to really feel this passion? Okay, to take action. Maybe taking your, your yeah. spirit. The first thing for me is that you need to have the right people around you. You will never go anywhere alone. I mean, you can go somewhere alone, but you will go so much further if you if you go in a team. And you have to understand that you cannot do it all on yourself by yourself. You may you may have one key skill, and you will have you will find another person that has another key skill, and then you form a team, and then you will have the skills that you need. The other thing that is really key also is that you have to be able to cooperate. Um, And, and meaning that you have to be able to cooperate is that you don't want to launch all your, all your projects thinking, oh, this will be my project and I will take all the pride for this thing. No, if you want, if you want some of the key issues that this world is facing to move forward, you have to put action first and pride next. Okay. Well, thank you very much, Caroline. Caroline. Thank you. <laughs> um, just to finish, okay, these were two questions. Just to finish, I would like to say to the camera, uh, Maybe a brief recommendation, okay, saying I'm Caroline Holland. Uh, I would like to encourage you to follow the Insiders Project, something like that, okay? Something I would like to, follow, to, to encourage to, you to... encourage you to follow the Insiders Project. Oh, okay. Just a recommendation for people to, to follow the project. Maybe they can get something in the future from us, okay? Okay, I'm Caroline Poulon uh, from Paris, France, although born in the US. Um, and I strongly encourage you to follow the Insiders Project because this is a great way to learn. And there is no way that you're going to learn just by remaining on your own. You need to be able to go and meet new people and, and take advantage of the experience. And that's exactly what Insiders will bring to you.